Welcome, in this video I'm going to show you how you can create a side-by-side -side box plot similar as the one showing here using Excel uh, 2016. This is a new feature in Excel 2016 so for earlier versions this will not work. I'll put a link in the description below to a website that actually shows how you can do a, s a box plot using Excel 2013 or earlier. Um, what I've here uh, have as data is locations one, two, and three, and the grades uh, that were given by each student. Now, for the three different locations, they actually belong to Demon, Harlem, and Rotterdam. So, in here, I've actually created a formula that will simply look up this value in that table, uh, return to me the second value, and only exact matches. I then copy pasted this down, so I would actually have all the information. Now the next thing I'm going to do is go for insert and then here at the charts part there is insert statistics chart and then go for the box and whisker. Now it's completely empty so I'm going to select some data and I'm going to add the series name is going to be the grades and the series values is going to be all of these so select all of those. Then my horizontal uh, category axis labels is actually all those locations. So going from here to the last one. Then click on OK and this should already give me a pretty decent side by side box plot. I can adjust it a little bit if I want to. Um, one thing that's hard to read is actually it's using an X to indicate the mean and it shows actually each data point with a little dot. So there are a few things we can actually change here. And let's begin with actually the vertical axis. The maximum grade was 100, so if I click on this or double click on it, then at least in here you should have the properties and I should be able to actually go for the axis option and limit this to 100. I don't perhaps need a chart title, so let's delete the whole thing. Oh. Let's make sure we select the chart title, then click delete. In the chart element, uh, add chart element, I might want to add a vertical axis and change that to grey. Mm, great. And if I click on one of these, I actually get the uh, different options and go to the series options and I don't want to see the inner points and perhaps the fill color might actually be nicer to do a solid fill in well let's keep it at orange that way the uh, the cross becomes a little bit better visible and this is how you can quickly create a side-by-side -side box plot using excel 2016. 